Hey, what's up, y'all? Hey, we're gonna get into doing a uh, trailer smoker. It's been a while since I've done a trailer. It hasn't been that long, I guess. I've done one beginning of the year. But this is gonna be a different style. This is one that I'm gonna try to get, uh, start doing several of them, just like some of the main models of the offsets and the reverse flows I do. But this is a small trailer. It'll have a small offset on it, but it's still a good size. I mean, it's one of the main sizes that I do. And to me, it's a perfect size for, for most things, unless you're cooking for a big party or something like that. But anyway, this is what we got going. Here's the trailer frame. It comes as a kit, and I already got it put together, except for putting the hitch and stuff on it. I did, uh, it comes with a straight neck, so I made some brackets to just bolt in there on both sides to make the neck a little bit stronger. And, uh, so that's all I've done to it so far. All I'm really, it's not going to be a whole lot done to that, because I'm going to make the pit bolt onto it as well. And I got the chamber done. I got the firebox done. And so I'm fixing to get the fitting these up and then get it raised up and put on there. And then we'll build the rest of it probably while it's on the trailer. All right, y'all, I went ahead and got the thing finished up. I know I skipped around a lot, didn't show a whole lot of it. But this is it. Offset smoker. 
a storage box on the front. I know at the beginning I said I wasn't gonna change the neck, but I ended up changing it anyway, making it longer and building a frame out to put a storage box on the front and to add a jack. I couldn't get a jack on the way it was before. It wasn't enough room for it. So anyway, I did go ahead and change all that up. But this is it. The chamber is uh 30 inches long, 22 inches deep, 18 inches wide. And it does have tuning plates in it. They're just stacked up in there right now. Coal rack down there. Firebox is about 18 by 18. Has an ash pan and propane log lighter in there. Has one burner mounted on the back. Plenty of table space there. Both the hoses come out to the back. Four inch smokestack. Everything's bolted to the trailer, so if you ever did want to take it off of there for some reason, it can come off. But everything came out real good on it. It's all 316th steel. Inch and seven eighths ball on it, or hitch on it. But anyway, that's it, y'all. Uh, this mod, I'm gonna do some more of these. This style right here is gonna be 1600, like it sits right now. And that's with the gaskets and clamps and uh, the log lighter and burner on the back and everything. Everything that you see here, it's going to be 1600 And uh, this one's already sold. But I'm going to do some more with reverse flows and stuff. So if you're looking for a trailer, be on the lookout for those. And uh, I'm gonna, I'm, it's going to be pretty soon. I got a few more pits I got to do in a fire pit and stuff. But th th it's going to be pretty soon. But anyway, be on the lookout for those. And on the next video, uh, I think it's going to be a barrel pit, a half-cut barrel is what I think, so be on the lookout for that, man. If y'all need a trailer like this, shoot me an email or any kind of pit. I'm going to put my email in the description box, and y'all shoot me an email and let me know what you're looking for. And we'll see y'all on the next one.